BZH and Big Zach's house. Today I wanted to show everybody how to do your own custom DIY do-it-yourself Lego display. So I purchased both of these from Michaels. These are $55 and then the tape in the inside, I'll show you everybody here. I got that for $13 off of Amazon. It's from a company, it's like a toy block tape, like a Lego tape. It was $13 and $13 will fit one shelf. So I got blue and I got black. I actually picked them up at a, uh, a Lego convention a few years back and I used it finally with these, but I did look it up on Amazon. There'll be an affiliate link in the description below for this tape if you guys want to use it. It's pretty good. Um, it comes like in a, in a plastic container and it fits enough for here. And then you, you basically cut it and you can measure it out and then it has a little um, tape on the bottom. You just pull the tape off and just stick it right on to the bottom of these shelves. So like I said, these shelves are from Michaels. They're $55 a piece. So at full retail, you got $55 and then $13. You made 68 bucks for a shelf. Now Michaels does offer coupons, so you can get this potentially for 20% off or more depending on what you buy. So while I'm gonna say this is a $68 shelf, it could potentially be like a $55 shelf. So um, I don't have a big reason as to why I put specific figures in, in my shelves here, but I have all my customs up here. So I, I did nine for each shelf here. So there was 54 in each one. So you got nine, 18, 27, 36, 4, 54. Uh, these here are my custom figs. I want to do the top two shelves with my custom figs. This is just for me. Um, you can do whatever you want for your shelves, but I just kind of set up a bunch of clones and all these and I'll do a bunch of different things here. So I will also post there some shelves you can pick up on Amazon if you don't want to go to Michaels, but it's not exactly these shelves. So just, you know, like I said, these are from Michaels directly. So if you're looking for something else on Amazon, I'll post something that's very similar, but not exactly. So you're looking at 16 inches from top to bottom for these. It has cool glass here. These are awesome. I can't wait to pick up some more. So again, 16 inches from top to bottom and then from your depth perspective here, your three and a half inches, which I think is important because you want to make sure you have enough room for the tape. And if you have any, like, there's any blasters or anything in your lightsabers, as you can see, it makes you have room for those. And then left to right, the shelf is 13 inches. So if you want to pick up one of the things, I'll put the, obviously again, the affiliate link. I want to make sure you get kind of similar. I don't want you to think that you're going to get the exact thing. Um, if you don't go to Michaels, I was lucky enough to get one of these shelves from Michaels like a year or two ago and I set it up and I just got another one. They're, they're kind of like intermittent when they're on their website But it's a really cool shelf. It's completely enclosed You don't have to worry about any dust when you put these in here And I think it's still actually pretty much a lot cheaper than if you get like a Lego display case where it has like the official Lego. We open up the, the doors and, and obviously you can do some different things here too. You don't have to use that specific tape, but I think it kind of looks cool and it's pretty price, you know, effective. And then on the back, you can hang these on the wall. So and I like this too, because it, it gives you a little bit of room for error. So if you put the screws and not completely, you know, the same exact what it needs to be from left to right. There's a little bit of room for air. I hate those like minutes like little holes and you have to be like exact to hang it up on the wall. So a little bit of room for air here. So let me know what you think. These shelves are freaking cool. Uh, I can't wait to hang these up on the wall. The basement's getting redone. I'll show everybody all the videos for that. Uh, let me know what you think. Please give this video a thumbs up. This is a great way to display some of your cool minifigures. Again, put 54 in here. I'll have the link for Marshalls. Uh, that link is not an affiliate link for me, unfortunately, but I want you guys to see. I picked this up, 54 minifigures. You can probably get them a little bit closer if you want, maybe get 60 in there, but I like to have a little bit of space in here. Uh, 54 minifigures, so if you have some valuable ones, hang them up on the wall. Really cool option here for you. Please give this video a thumbs up. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos. And thank you guys for watching.